my name is Diane. I'm a Master Gardener volunteer here in Santa Clara County, California. Sometimes in our garden, we need to use a pesticide. Today, we will learn how to read a pesticide label. The first step in buying a pesticide is to identify the problem to be treated. Next, find a product that is formulated to kill the pest. But before making your purchase, read as much of the label as you can to be sure this product is the right one for the problem. Some labels contain lengthy, detailed information. Some labels contain minimal information. The pesticide label tells us the manufacturer's brand name, what pest the product will treat. Pesticides are designed to kill different types of pests found in the home or garden. The most common are fungicides to kill fungi and sometimes mold, insecticides to kill insects, miticides to kill mites, molluscicides to kill snails and slugs, herbicides to kill weeds. The pesticide label tells us what the active ingredient is as a percentage of the pesticide. What inert or inactive ingredients are included as a percentage of the pesticide? The Environmental Protection Agency registered product number. How to use the pesticide safely and effectively, including whether special applicators or sprays must be used. How to store the pesticide. How safely to dispose of the residual pesticide and container. How to give first aid. Pesticides are required to show precautionary statements. These include danger, poison, showing a skull and crossbones, always in red. This means the ingredients are highly toxic to humans and potentially deadly in low dosage. Danger. This means that the ingredients are harmful to humans and can cause irreversible eye or skin injuries. Warning. This means the ingredients are moderately harmful to humans and can cause moderate eye or skin irritation. Caution. This means the ingredients are somewhat harmful to humans and may cause slight eye or skin irritation. No warning. This can mean that the ingredients pose little risk of harm to humans. Regardless of the warning sign, all pesticides should be kept away from children. So that's how to read a pesticide label. Thanks for dropping in. Music by Kevin McLeod.